Hey guys, it's Jackson here from Titanic Games, and today I'm going to be showing you how to create a custom um, landscape with a height map, rather than using the uh, landscape tools that Unreal provides. Um, so in the previous tutorial I showed you how to actually use the landscape tools, but in this one we're going to, rather than creating a new one, we're going to import one from file by using a height map. So now the way I'm going to create this height map is I'm going to use Photoshop to do it, uh, but you can use you know any kind of picture editing software um, that is available to you, um, and kind of some of the similar concepts apply. So uh, first thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to create a new little project thing, and I'm going to you know set my um, pic pixels or the the width and height to 2048 by 2048 in pixels, and the width and height define um, not only you know your picture's resolution, but uh, or size, but the uh, how big it'll actually be inside of Unreal. So a 2048 by 2048 is going to be pretty big. You could do you know 4096 by 4096 or lower, you know like uh, 1024 by 1024. Um, but kind of the key thing is just to make sure that you keep it in powers of two, um, and you should be good to go. So then. Uh, you know, define your resolution, and then we want to make sure that our color mode is set to grayscale. Um, otherwise, uh, some um, your height map data might be interpreted incorrectly in Unreal Engine 4. So uh, make sure it's set to grayscale. And then um, for me, I just set my background contents to other and chose white, or I mean uh, black. But you can do really any color; it doesn't matter. Um, so yeah, set it to black, and then just hit OK. So we've got this black image now, all right. And basically, what we want to do is um, use, you know, colors on the grayscale, so black to white, to create our height map, right? So the value black is going to be the lowest that you can go on um, your height map, or the or the lowest that will actually show up in the landscape, all right? So if you have something like you know, a beach or like a sea level kind of area, you'll probably want it to be closer to black. Let's say you have like a mountain, um, you'll want to, you know, make it white or whiter because then that that value will be interpreted as higher than the black. Um, so, uh, just really quickly, I'm going to, you know, use some of the tools to kind of show this. Um, Alright, so I've got my color picker now and basically what I'm going to do is um, so we're starting with black right black is the lowest now I'm gonna you know just choose a value that's higher than black so kind of a dark gray hit OK and then um, I'm gonna make my size a little bigger and then I'm just gonna start you know coloring in All right so really simple so you can color in like this um, you know pick another color maybe some lighter this time you know, draw it in there. You know, make it even whiter now. Draw that, and then finally I'll make it uh, completely white. All right, and for this I'm going to dial down the size. You know, put the white in the very middle. And so now that we've done that, we want to go to File, and say Export, Export as, and then we want to make sure we do a PNG. All right, and then make sure the width and height is all. Uh, you know, correct. Um, and then just go ahead and hit export all. all right, and I'm going to save this as height map. Um, rather, I'll just call this test test height map. All right. All right. So now you can see here it is on our desktop, and we can go back into Unreal. And now, um, you know, with the landscape tool selected, we pick import from file, and then we click this little button. And now we can pick our uh, PNG height map to import. So I'll go ahead and click it. I'll open it. And now if I you know, kind of zoom out really quick, um, you can see here's our height map. Right. So um, once it actually imports, it's going to look a little different than this. Uh, but it kind of shows you the rough outline of it. And now another thing is you'll notice the height map resolution. Right. It auto populates it. And it also will set the size of your landscape for you. So now you can just go ahead and hit import. 
All right, Unreal just crashed on me, but um, I opened it back up and imported it, and now you'll see it looks, you know, something like this. So there you have it. You know, it's really easy to kind of create, um, you know, a lands, you know, a custom landscape based on a height map image. Um, and you know, looking in really close, you can see this kind of it's really jagged. Um, but the cool thing is, you know, way down here. So this was our black value before, and it's the lowest. And then as we go up, you know, we got closer to white. And then right up here is the absolute, you know, white value. And so that's kind of how a, um, a height map works. So um, now, you know, if you want to get rid of kind of the ruggedness, you can use your smooth tool and kind of, you know, smooth it out a little bit. So it's not so rough or jagged, I guess. Um, so yeah, you can do stuff like that, and then you can start, you know, sculpting on it, doing other stuff you might want to do, or whatever. So, um, thanks for watching, and if you liked the video, like or subscribe, and we will see you in the next one.